How often can you drink coffee while pregnant? I heard that it was dangerous for the baby. It can certainly make things rough for both of you. Caffeine heightens your anxiety while making the kid jittery. He can't get jittery. Fine, more active. And then you can't rest with him kicking your bladder or bouncing around like a ping pong ball. More like a football at this stage. The March of Dimes says you shouldn't have more than one cup of coffee a day. I could switch to soda. Which would mean two Cokes or one and a half cans of Pepsi. But you could have all the caffeine-free diet soda you want. I might as well drink decaffeinated coffee. But I've heard people say even that is bad. Both coffee and soda are mildly acidic and can worsen morning sickness. And they both taste bad coming back up. Maybe I should try more lemon water or seltzer. I don't care how much sugar you put in lemon water, it all tastes bad coming back up. I don't know if I can give up coffee. Brew your own coffee and use half as much coffee to make it. That's as bad as using half as much sugar to make cookies. Add more milk and sugar to the coffee instead of drinking it black. Why do they say to minimize caffeine while pregnant? It raises your heart rate and blood pressure, which isn't good when you are pregnant. And it raises the baby's metabolic rate. I don't think either of those are harmful long term, compared to fears about pesticides and air pollution and vaccines. Caffeine dehydrates you, which is bad when you are pregnant. So do a lot of other things. It makes you pee a lot more, when you already have to go a lot more. Oh, geez, I need to cut back.